Another type of post you can make in Google Classroom is to make an announcement. To do so, be sure you're on the stream page, find where it says share something with your class, and click on it. You will see this box pop up. This allows you to type your announcement, in this case 1984 projects are due next week. I can post, which will post it immediately. If I click on the arrow, I can schedule, so if you are a pre-planner, you can schedule it to post at a certain date and time. Or you can save it as a draft if you aren't fully ready to post it to your classroom. On an announcement, you also have the ability to add an attachment, something from your drive, from YouTube, as well as a link to another resource on the web. If you're adding from your drive, you simply click Drive. In this case, I have my 1984 project guideline. Items you've worked on recently will show up in your recent section, but you can also click on Drive and find an item that you have saved earlier. You click Add, and then you would post. Students will see the post immediately. Here you can see this is an announcement. And there are the guidelines that I just posted as a teacher. You may have noticed on the student side that students also have the ability to post announcements. If you do not want your students to have the ability to do so, click on your settings gear, scroll down, and in the stream, students can post and comment, you can change this. They can only comment or only teachers can post and comment. The default is that students can post and comment, but if you don't want them posting their own things, but you do want them to comment on anything that you have posted, you should change that to students can only comment.